reality of being an entrepreneur, being a DIY entrepreneur, working from home, um, it can be very hectic. And procrastination is a mother. <laughs> To my channel if you don't know my name is kiara and this is the kiara nicole way on this channel i typically talk about content creation tips advice guidance and resources and i share brand mentorship and my entrepreneurship journey as well so today i'm bringing you guys a studio vlog it's been a while since i've done one of these but i want to make sure that i don't get too caught up in like trying to be so educational with my content that I forget why I started YouTube in the first place, which is just to have a place to share my videos. I truly enjoy making this type of content, so I just want to, you know, kind of put that out there. But anyway, today we have a studio vlog. It's literally 4 p.m. Yes, it is 4 o'clock. I mean, such a late start, but I woke up, I had something to do kind of early and I got that done. And then I was just having a really good conversation with a friend of mine. So finally at three or so, I decided that I would do some work and then it came to me like, oh, hey, you should vlog because I have a video that I'm editing right now. Um, but it's just been, I've been procrastinating. So you will see me editing that video during this vlog. And I just wanted to share some updates. Over the course of the like end of last year, I wanna say towards from September to maybe like now, I've been doing a lot of client work. So that's kind of where I've been. When I do my studio vlogs, nine times out of 10, I'm sitting right here at this desk, which I call my studio, and I'm doing some type of project or something. I haven't really been able to focus so much on my own stuff because I've been doing a lot of client work and I'm going to share some of that some of the just stuff that I've been working on with you guys. I also had to upgrade my lighting setup because my ring light broke on me in the middle of me recording and I'll probably enter like the Instagram story that I did of you know that whole ordeal. It is always something, it's always going to be something, and it's up to you whether you're going to use that as an excuse to stop, quit, and give up, or if you just pick up the pieces and keep it moving. Had to buy a new ring light, but guess what? This ring light comes with a microphone, so maybe it'll be a better investment than the one I had before. You know, you just have to look at setbacks. You got to see the good in it, basically, is what I'm trying to say. So, y'all have y'all a good day. I'm about to go in here and try to get this video done that I've been putting off for a couple days now. So, peace. So, I guess it wasn't RIP because my good girlfriend gave me a hike. Look at that. Look at that. Now we have double the lighting, double the fun. Yes. But someone gave me a hack that I could fix my ring light. So here I am with a fancy new system. It came with a mic. Honestly, the mic is not even plugged in right now. It's really not. Um, I don't even know if this thing works, but it felt fancy to get a new ring light with the mic attached to it. I feel like I'm in a real studio. So... <laughs> But yes, that is what has been up with me. Just a lot of client work and um, really getting on the ball with social media management and content creation and just building my foundation, establishing my foundation rather and building from that. And it's been very exciting. I will say that I'm not pressed for work, guys. I <laughs> People are hitting me up, but now it's just a matter of making sure that the people that I decide to work with are clients that I actually want to be taking and not just taking because maybe we know each other or maybe, um, you know, I think that all clients are good clients right now in this phase of my business, but it's all a learning process and I'm learning and I'm growing and I'm having so much fun. So that's enough talking for me. Let's get into this studio vlog. Okay, so I start my work day by checking out my to-do list. 
Um, nine times out of ten, I write my to-do list before the day before. So I will come to my desk, look at it, see what I need to do. A lot of these tasks are, well, no, only one of these tasks is taken from yesterday. <laughs> it literally says edit and post YouTube video last day, underline, underline. Because I have just been procrastinating on getting this video edited. So right now I'm just going through this footage and seeing if it's usable. Oh, that looks nice. Can you see? Can you see? Okay. That one's usable. If it's not, I'm just writing it down so I can go and remember to just delete it. But I think all of these pretty much are. But yeah, so I'm going to finish going through these and then I'm going to finish going through these and get to editing. So I took a break to eat some food and it is late. So we're going to pick this vlog back up tomorrow. I'm about to finish editing this video, get it up and post it tonight. So the video will be up before the vlog, but yeah, I will see y'all in the morning because a sister is tired. Oh my goodness. So it's a whole new day. And again, it's three o'clock. Like my days just slip by me, honestly. So I woke up this morning and got my Tuesday tip video done for Instagram and I'll put that here. Hey y'all, it is time for a tip and today's tip is don't overthink it. Yes, I'm talking about the content creation process. If you find yourself beating yourself up during the design portion or not being able to decide on what to post, this tip is for you. Danielle Leslie said it best, done is better than perfect. Perfectionism and content creation will handicap you. To avoid this, create a process that works for you. Content creation is not a one size fits all type of deal. So find what works for you, have fun with it, and remember, don't overthink it. Peace. And shame on me for not batching, but sometimes I get really overwhelmed. And again, I do have client work to do as well. So I scheduled all of my clients posts for the month, um, well, for the first half of the month. Um, so I haven't really had time to sit down and do my own, but nonetheless, we're gonna get it done. So I finished my Tuesday tip video and I was gonna go get some food, like maybe some Chipotle or just some type of food that's already made. But I'm like, let me be smart. It's snowing. Let me go grocery shopping. So now I'm sitting outside of the grocery store and I have no idea what I wanna eat, no idea what I wanna get. Um, so I'm gonna keep sitting out here, but then when I get back in the house, I'm gonna go back to editing the video because it's still not done. <laughs> Still not done, but I'm gonna go back to editing my YouTube video and then make my notepad and then try to get some planning done. Oh, also I wanna go to dance class. You see how everything just, uh, it's always, okay, so then I have to put something off. That is a true struggle. But anyway, I'm rambling and I'll be back. I feel like I haven't seen snow in a long time. And it's steady coming down too. Good morning. This is like day three of me trying to get this vlog together, y'all. I still haven't finished editing this video. To be honest with you, I'm not really feeling it. So I'm trying to figure out ways to make it just a little bit more something because I'm not feeling it. So right now I am getting some client work done. Um, so I'm about to create a graphic to post on my client's story. I also have to create my content for the day. I still have my notepad to make and I still need to finish this video. So let's hope today we actually get these things done. This has just been like a drag and I don't even know what this vlog is going to look like at this point, but...
Okay, y'all, so this is all of the content. Okay, guys, I just want to show you that I finished scheduling my content for today. Um, outside of that, I still need to edit this YouTube video. I'm really going to buckle down and get that done right now. Create my notepad for one of my customers. And um, I also need to like just upload my content into Trello so it's already there. I know it needs to be done. And then batch some content as well. So I'm going to try to get to all of that today and take you guys with me. This is the reality of being an entrepreneur, being a DIY entrepreneur, working from home. Um, it can be very hectic and procrastination is a mother like procrastination will literally cripple you so I just wanted to show y'all the real the raw and the truth if you're new to my channel and you haven't had the opportunity to go and check out some of my vlogs this is what it is with me I like to keep it real I'm not one of those influencers who is trying to portray a perfect life my life is far from perfect i don't have it all together but i do believe that watching other people's journeys can be inspiring to maybe those who haven't started yet or to those who are where you are or even those beyond where you are they might get inspired just by seeing you continue to work for what you want so keep going i just wanted to let you guys know that and give you an update on where we are with time it's approximately 11 49 so an earlier start than the previous days however there's still a lot to get done so let's get into it as y'all can see it is 8 4 on wednesday and i'm just now pressing export on this video moment of honesty and transparency i really still am not the most comfortable with this video um i did a lot of I don't know like I just feel like I tried to shoot it in one day and I was getting frustrated and I just started to mess up a lot on camera so I'm a little self-conscious about this video like I'm exporting it now but I'm not too convinced that I want to post it and this is like the third day of me feeling like this so eh, I don't know um but yeah here we are another day of procrastination um, but I'm not too hard on myself about it because I know that I need the mental break. Um, I handle my client's business and then literally didn't edit the video all day until the end of the day. So I'm about to shut down and we'll pick this up tomorrow. And this is just a part of the entrepreneurship life that nobody, no one really speaks about. Um... Or I'm not going to say they don't speak about it. I don't see too much about it. Um, but going through it, I don't know. I just feel like it's okay. Like, it's a part of the process and it's a part of the journey. Like, it can be frustrating because it's like, girl, if you just sit and get it done and get it out of the way, it'll be done. But I don't know. There's something... And then I'm also not too hard on myself about tasks like this because it's not technically bringing me any income. So the things that I that bring me income, those are the things I focus on. But I know that these are income producing things possibly. Um, and so that possibility is what keeps me going. And um, yeah, I honestly don't even know if this vlog is going to get posted. I'll see. Yeah, being vulnerable, being honest about my process has always been a thing for me. Um, so, yeah. Literally nothing else done on my to-do list. And I just want to get my content out of the way so I don't have to focus on it. Um, so, yeah. That's where I am. That's where I am in my process.
Okay, y'all. So I just finished. Um, finally, let this be a lesson that procrastination will literally kill you. Look at what I did. I've been, I just looked at my order. Like I had the order for 12 days now. This literally took me maybe all of 30 minutes to cut it down. And now I'm about to put the glue on it and it'll be ready to ship. Procrastination. But then it's lunchtime, so I will be back. So taking the padding compound in my brush and my stack and just put in the first layer of glue on here. So if you ever want to make notepads for your brand, your own brand, it's extremely easy. Very, very easy to make. I definitely should have put some protection on this front page, but I'll just rip it off if anything. All right, now time to go eat while I let that dry. Good morning, good morning, good morning. It's like day a thousand of this vlog, y'all but i'm in a much better mood procrastination is slowly but surely leaving and right now i'm preparing for two consultations that i have today my first one actually starts in three minutes so i'm gonna make this quick but yes that's what i'm doing today i'm gonna set the camera up and get ready to start my day <sighs> hey y'all so right now it is 908 the consultation i do 15 minutes i don't even know if you guys can see me i know my my um sound is probably off because i have my vent on but my consultations last for 15 minutes it's currently 908 it was set to start at nine o'clock so that's it um so i will prepare for my one at 11 in the meantime i will do everything that i need to do as far as um content for the day and my to-do list that I didn't finish yesterday and all of that stuff so let's get into it okay there you go good morning good morning good morning how are you I'm here yes yeah it counts for something I feel that <laughs> after that disaster of a studio vlog um here I am again um taking this weekend this valentine's day weekend um to just relax i just took a bath and i'm about to take brand photos today so i thought i would take y'all with me for that i'm whispering because we're trying to because somebody's trying to sleep but um yes after that disaster of a vlog i am back again i'm here and We'll get these brand photos done. Um, I'm going to set up my camera. I'm on like a little mini getaway for the weekend. It's Valentine's Day weekend. And yeah, I feel much better. I feel a lot more focused. Sometimes you got to step away from everything that's going on to gain new perspective. Um, so I'm going to continue to do that today. I'm not really going to work too hard on anything. I just want to take the photos. I'm really not up for it, but I'm going to get up, clean up, put on my makeup and stuff, and then get started. So let's go. Okay, y'all. So I literally had a plan to show you me cleaning up and show you get show myself getting ready and all of that, but I clearly suck but anyway i'm finished my makeup i took my hair out and i actually really like it so now i'm about to set up and take my pictures and yeah the scene is set period so i honestly think that this part you know, me showing y'all how I shot my brand, photo shoot and all that. It's going to be a part of my studio vlog that I just been working on. Um, 
I know this has been completely all over the place, but it's okay because we're here. <laughs>